Wow. Look how dark it is. It is. Right. Welcome back, everybody. It's Tuesday evening. What time is it? Uh, 20 past seven. 20 past six, sorry. 20 past six. We've not fit a door on here yet, so we've actually bodged one with a bit of ply and cardboard just to keep the heat in. Both selectors doing a bit of overtime, just uh, management on the eBay, editing a few listings, stuff like that. We've got a few people doing a bit of overtime because it has literally just been that busy. We've not recorded for two days, uh, but John's here. And we've got a special guest as well. We've got Marky Boy in the mix. Hey, Marky Boy. How are we doing, Marky Boy? Uh, Have you look at his, he's gained the belly, John, since he's been yeah. gone. What's yeah. it like that? That's I'm going good. a bit greyer. That's a stress I'm, I'm, new job, isn't it? Yeah, but I'm I'm I'm, I'm going a bit greyer, but I haven't got I haven't lost my looks and I haven't lost my feet. Well you can't you can't lose something that you never had, pal, <laughs> <can> you? <laughs> God damn it. Right, anyway, John, we you come down before we owe him an ultimate shout out. Ultimate shout out? You mate? Oh Peter. Ninja Pete. Ninja Pete. Dancing feet. I just want to say thanks for coming down all the way from Scotland. Yeah. We was unbelievably busy, but we made the time for you. We because did. for you to come down and go out your way to see us, we can go out of our way to see you. And give you a shout out. And the first thing you said was, I've watched every video. You've watched every so video. What can you do? You've seen it from the start. What would you have done, Messels, if someone had said he's watched every video? You could like, not retire and give them a free cup. Oh, no, no, we didn't need to give him a free one. He said he's bought the bundle. Yeah, so he's already bought the bundle. Pete. Is it Don't get me wrong, I should have given you some air fresheners. Oh, I, thought, I, I thought about that when you went. Yeah. So, next time you come down, I'll give you some air fresheners. <laughs> <laughs> so, yeah, Ninja Pete, there's your shout out. But now, uh, we've, yeah, we've had a long day. We've managed to get on top of a lot. I think it's still a catching up game from yeah, the, the yeah. wards, and Nathan was actually still catching up. Still. Yeah. That, that day and a half of being off on the awards nights, we're still feeling the backlash of that now. So we're just putting in that extra little bit to make make up for it. Uh, tomorrow, I've got three minibuses to, to collect. Why am I suttering? Uh, so I'm gonna collect them in the DAF. I've got uh, an Arctic wagon coming for steel engines. I've got auto save 50 this? yard coming for alloy engines. Go. And I've got Bales going. So it's going to be mega busy tomorrow, but I'll show you that. I'm going to definitely get some footage. Okay, everybody. It's gone from dark yesterday to dark this morning. Uh, it's Wednesday morning. Me and Chris and John have just come in that little bit earlier, and I've had to get Chris a, a brew just to butter him up a little bit. We're going to be bailing first thing just to get a, a load gone in the morning. So it's about half six in the morning, so it's not drastically early, but it's just that little hour and a half extra. Uh, and then we can get the bales gone. And before eight o'clock, you know, we've done quite a lot already. And then it just takes the pressure off the rest of the day. So I need to get some diesel in the machine. Uh, and Chris is actually trying to set up a light on the baler. We did have one set up, but uh, I don't know why someone's pulled the clips off the end so it's not even connected now did you find one i'm going to sort it by uh took me two minutes have you got your brew i've got well, yeah i've got my brew yeah are we still buddies for life or not we're still buddies for life yeah yeah this rain don't get us down in fact like i said it only makes us stronger it does three ton tries to get in between us a little bit but it's gonna have to be better than that but i'm gonna put some diesel in mine so yeah it is a bit miserable Bit cold and wet but the machine's nice and warm that's the main thing so I'm gonna quickly fill up a couple of drums now and then get it in the machine and crack on I'll show you that also I'm gonna be trying to show you a lot of what I do today because I've got quite a busy day today and we haven't got any footage this week uh, so i'm going to be showing you what i do today and that should be quite a lot of footage actually right, so i've just took the drums down now to let in the machine quickly warm up 
and I've chucked these drums in for five minutes so all them oils get round it and warm and I'm going to crack on with the bailing. Luckily with this machine it's got the floodlights on which really help like especially when it's dark in the mornings and at night and it's got two at the top and two at the bottom and two behind it so it just gives you the like that opportunity to do a bit at night. I mean, obviously, I'd have, I'd have fit some anyway, but just a job what we didn't need to do. Right, Chris has been messing about with that, and he's managed to set up a bit of a light. How's it looking? Do you want me to start it now? We can do it. Right. So, same with the bail. We're just going to give this five minutes to warm up, and then bail time. Pull them clips off the batteries rather than we're not needing them. Yeah. Alright, we ready? Yep. Look at that, instant there. No heat, nothing. Scratch up straight away. Morning to you all. Oh, no, we should have just done it. Is that the point? <laughs> right, I've said. I'm going to record everything today. <laughs> no, I mean everything I do. All oh, right. Well, I'll try and do a bit as well. Listen, boys. What about the John really? Secret Treasures? John Season Treasures. <sighs> the new mini series, which never even got revealed. I had a plan to do a secret. To do a, what I find in the cars, but I just, I just didn't do it. I'm sorry. Right. To get that camera. So, yeah. Right, anyway, this is I'm going to jump on that bailer. You've obviously explained everything, haven't you? Yeah. So, I'm going to get on there. I'm going to leave the camera with John and I'll see you when I finish bathing. No, no, no. Okay. Yeah, you might have to knock it off. Yeah, we'll do it. So, guys, hope you're enjoying. Um, I know we keep on saying it and people are actually getting annoyed at us, but I think just the way it's going, it's just. I personally, I think it's growing just a little bit too fast really and things things are seeping through like little problems like just even down to keeping bits of the yard tidy or keeping an area organized you've got to don't forget we've got all the stocks on the shelves so we need to make sure all that keeps organized all the time and like if you ever lose a part that's that's not good that means some incompetence somewhere has happened so any problems we try to track down so just yeah. so you know the wagon is coming like what's right right i'm just thinking about that front what's there that's on that shoulder at night let's get near to me when he comes in yeah because i'm gonna be on there till we get here right boy yeah plenty of bells going so yeah he's been busy with the cars the cars oh i think that's why I think that also getting busy we say busy i mean you might think oh the seven nodes and doing this but it's it's selling, but it's just keeping it a happy medium with the selling. We're, we're managing to keep on top of that. We're managing, managing to keep the parts getting advertised and the parts going on the racks. But the more cars what come in, obviously there's more pressure then on the machine work, the bailing, the depollution, the deciding what happens with the cars. Um, now sometimes if you get too many cars come in, it's you don't want to bin everything because stuff's worth money, but you physically cannot keep it. So sometimes you're having to bin stuff you don't really want to bin. Which means we need a bigger yard and more racks and more shelving space. But it's not a bad problem to have. I mean, being busy is not bad. I keep on saying it, but hope everyone's managing. Hope everyone's all right. I'm going to crack on now with just keeping on top of all my emails. Bit, bit of eBay, probably averaging about 120 emails a day on eBay, but I've been doing eBay since I was 14, so I know what I'm doing and I can blitz through it very quickly. I've got like a little routine, so that's why I do it and I keep the eBay in good standing. The eBay's perfect, no case has gone to support, so that's 0%. The returns rates um, going on hitting towards low. If it ever hits towards very high, um, eBay can actually charge more money on the percentage fees. So yeah, I'm just keeping it in good standing. It's keeping good communication with customers, making returns easier, 
Um, if there's ever a problem, just fix it straight away. Customer, 99% of the time is happy. You only very rarely get a hard work customer. Um, but even then you can still, you can still um, sweet talk them. That's what you've got to do. Customer's always right, aren't they? So yeah, I'm going to crack on now and get it done. Also, for the people who have like their own yards and stuff, there's that technical competence. We have to keep it updated, but yeah. We're having the guy doing the technical competence and then we're going to have, um, I think we're going to get two more members of staff in the yard because basically they're saying you, they need to have proof of someone with technical competence. It's like a course you can take who is always on the yard in operating hours. So say I'm on holiday, they need to know that someone else who knows what, knows that basically it's for the people who don't really know what it is. It's knowing everything on the environmental factors and keeping the place running safely. Um, so if I'm not here, there needs to be someone else here who can keep it running safely and environmentally friendly. That's basically what it means. Even down to if you take a battery out of a car, it needs to then go into a sealed container undercover. So it needs to be double bonded. The battery is bonded itself the battery's sealed itself, but it needs to be in a bund because if one of them batteries cracks, then the liquid goes onto the floor, which they don't want. Yeah, we do have the interceptor tank. So if there is little drops of oil, which they expect, you, you can't stop a drop of oil. That is it, it happens. It's, cars, they, they could even be leaking oil when they first come in. But as long as if when the car first comes in, it's on hard standing ground with the interceptor tank, then that deals with obviously the oils what do spill. We don't spill, we don't really spill oil, but there's oil seepage. Um, and then the interceptor tank, I would say around once a year, will get emptied and then we can get our waste transfer note for the interceptor tank to prove that it's being disposed of safely. So we'll, yeah, we'll get a waste transfer note for that. Um, and the same with all the scrap what goes, you need to receive all your waste transfer notes and hazardous waste notes for the hazardous stuff, which includes catalytic converters, they're hazardous. Um, but as long as you keep all your paperwork and then when you're filing your waste return, you, you've got all your paperwork there. I put it all in date order, perfectly there. So when I come to do my waste return, I can see the full record of all my cars what have come in. And I've got all my paperwork in date order, down to the bales, from the cats to the batteries, to everything, everything what goes out, even down to the interceptors and getting emptied. I've got it all in a file, ready to do. So it literally, it'll probably take like, when, when it comes up to filing the waste return, I'd spend a day on it and I'd get it done. So it's not too bad. How's everyone doing? Me and Jay's got in early this morning, I don't know if we said before. I've done my hour and a half now. I've fully done all my eBay messages down here. There's just a few little bits I need to do, like get pictures of parts on cars for people. Everyone's in now, I've got everyone going. And um, everyone has signed on a task. So right now, it's, what time is it? It is, it's 10 minutes past eight, and everyone's cracked on already. Everyone's doing something. All the engines are going away, cars are being stripped already, he's on with the picking and the packing already. Um, James and Chris are still on the baler and the machine now. Um, they're due to finish in a minute. James is just keeping Chris on the baler until we've unloaded the sprinter. Um, and then he can come off the baler straight on to driving. Efficiency. So yeah, James is just finishing off now. Um, we've got quite... A good amount of bales. People keep on saying about the bale they're not squeezing them all the way in but yeah there might be a pressure problem but at the end of the day we're still getting paid the right amount um, and we're still getting the weight into the Arctic wagons. So for us it's a cheap baler and it gets us onto that ladder. It gets us going with the bales and being able to load the Arctics. It was cheap. Do you know what I mean? It wasn't a 200, 150,000 pound baler. It was very cheap. So yeah, it does the job. Nice little run that one, buddy. 
We bang a few out then. You're alright there. Yeah? <laughs> Let's go and have a brew, buddy. Come on. Don't let Freetum know, though. We'll go for a brew. Yeah. I've just explained everything. Right. So, we've just fired out probably. I bet we did 25 bales then. Uh, it's just kind of keeping the scrap at bay. How many would you say then? 25? 25, 30, not a bit, Listen, you're never going to beat us. Nope. We've had many a try, you can break our bonds, but all that it's doing is getting us stronger, isn't it? It just makes it bitter, doesn't it? I'm going to go and have a brew. Well, when we have brews, we fold, we well, leave the arm. Some bad news. Well, oh, and we've got the bin in. Also, Chris, uh, he started doing window repairs if anyone wants windows fixed. Do you like it? <laughs> That's something you do that, isn't it? That's something I do. Yeah, no, that's window tint. Look at the race map. Uh, right, so, wagon should be here any minute now. We're just going to get that boxed off, and then I've got three minibuses to collect from, uh, is it Aki College? Yeah. So, well, it's not a contract, but just every couple of years when they get new ones, yeah, they seem to give us the old ones. Well, not give, but scrap them with us. Uh, so, yeah. Now this is where the Leyland Daft's going to come in handy. Eh? It's because we, we, we have the college students. We have the college students every now and again, don't we? As you well, they'll use us. Wow, what's happened? Come on, John, where's the coffee? Oh, no. There's tea bags. I've just had a tea. You've already had a tea bag this morning, though, before. Not <laughs> <What> are you? <laughs> <laughs> not before we started. Yeah, 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 that last night, wasn't it? Looks like rubbing a tea bag, doesn't it? Ah! I'm not having no, tea. No, no, honestly, put two tea bags in, let it brew for a little bit. It's not bad. I'm not having tea. James, it's not. It's easy, yeah. James, honestly, I've got that good Yorkshire. No, that, them ones. Yorkshire gold. These Yorkshire, no, they're good, honestly. I'd say they're well. No, they're like weird coffee sachet things. Oh, well, they've got machines. Yeah. Let's have Yorkshire tea. So just, uh, I don't want tea. James, on, honestly. No, no, I'm ready. I don't James, even need yeah, it. Yeah, yeah. Right, so, I'll show you when the uh, wagon gets here. Yeah, yeah I guarantee there'll be coffee in reception. <laughs> oh my god, it's down. It will be. Go and rob the coffee jar, Jim. Can we go and rob a bit go of coffee? On, it's it. like rivalry with the coffee. James won't be happy though, will he? No. Don't pass it though, does it? Right. You have a tea. <laughs> <laughs> you bought me off. No, with, you've got a tea bag. You bought me off with turd, and right. then yeah, you go and get. I coffee. can probably win my way into the reception and get yeah. the coffee. So I'm gonna. Shall I tell you what, Chris? Or not? Yeah, go on. Right, you right, you do that, and then we'll unload that free lender. You're driving, aren't you? Armour. Yeah. Yeah. Right. Nice height as well. Right, okay. Even Chris put his order in, didn't you? And we yeah, did. Yeah. I, char I charged you for that, didn't I? Yeah. Got it there. So there you go. If it wasn't good, Chris wouldn't to bought it. But. Well, well, I said they're thermal, but they still let your head breathe, don't they? They're good hats, yeah. They are good. Really that warm. looks like a bit of the train is put down to that. <laughs> sorry. It's it's like a, it, it looks like a nipple. <laughs> <laughs> Not better. Yeah, that's better. Right, I'm going to go and uh, ransack more selector. Right, damn it, Bob. Can I nick a bit of your coffee? No. Please! <laughs> I'm just having one scoop. <laughs> and I'll, I'll top it up. Look at that. <laughs> no, we've oh, got there. no milk. You've already put milk. Oh, yeah, we're trying, we're trying to scare Bob. Well, we'll save you a bit of milk for a bit of coffee, how's about that? Right, anyway, so... Oh, what up, what else, John? You are? What Kenko? You're on Kenko? Oh, that's a good one. I'm going to say you're not popular for that. I'm popular for the Kenko. You're on the, uh, the Aldi one. The Aldi split. Let's go on. Learn is real. Oh, there. Right, I'm coming now. Right, uh, what's in the way? Uh, a lot more. What do you need to move? Depends on which way it's coming. I need oil drainer. Uh, you need what? <laughs> <laughs> oh, the oil, yeah. I'll get it sorted. Uh, 
that, James. Right, we'll load this. See you in a few minutes. John might show you a couple of little clips, but he's probably won't. This is Nathan's dream. No, it's not. It's a 1.6, uh, 1.4, so it's not really. Oh, you'd be if it had the 19 PD in there. Oh yeah. Nathan would have. Yeah, he'd have a mess in the front of his undies. <laughs> <laughs> no, but you can't argue that is not a very clean golf. Every golf you'll ever see at this age will be rotten off. I tell you what, lad, it's clean. Very, very clean. I have not seen a single bit of rot on this car. <laughs> Nothing. Yeah. Shame it's a fucking hard though. Yeah, it is. But. There is a good market for the Mark IV Golfs, parts are sought after. Them so wings will definitely sell. We're going to sell a few. Uh, anyway, the camera died just as we was uh, sending Mulaney's out with the bales. So we didn't show you that, so I just want to apologise. <laughs> uh, I'm going to go and get these minibuses from Aki College now. And then uh, I've got, uh, what else? Well there's three, there's one from Nelson as well. We need to get that door from your aunties, don't we? Yeah. All of us, uh, Auntie and Uncle, Rob and Tracy have donated us a free door, so thank you Rob and Tracy. Oh, and a stool as well, aren't they? Yeah. I think they just want to get rid of the stool though, don't they? <laughs> so we need to go and get that. Uh, right, are you going to, who's building that desk, Oliver? Yeah. Are you going to do that after? Yeah. Right, sorted. Right, I'm going to get this Audi off the daft and then I'll see you at the college. Oh, it's, I'm just thinking it's at a good time. Okay, got me off guard there, boys. Uh, this, me and John are in the truck together. I don't know why, but no, no I think we're only, we're only going because if one of these minibuses drive, we're actually going to drive it back. With the insurance we've got, we're allowed to, to drive as it. As long as it's got MOT yeah. and tags, and, uh, it's only two minutes down the road anyway. So we're going to do that. And John can get a bit of footage as well. Uh, what else? That's it. It's a bit of a. It's not really good time. It's not really good for us to go and collect the cars, but every now and again we just. It's and it empty. actually gives us a chance to talk about yeah. the yard. Like me and John during the day, honestly, we don't even have 10 minutes to talk to each other. Yeah. It's always at the end of the day and in the mornings. That's when we have our little management talks of what's going on. So even now, this little 15 minutes, if I'm looking at traffic, it could be an hour and 15 No, I think there must be roadworks down here. Yeah, sort of. So we can get a bit of an action plan this afternoon. Uh, I think Jarrett wants to come down for the alley engines. Again? Yeah. yeah. And then we've got an Arctic come in, steel engines. God, I think there'd be too much weight in it. No, 25 tonne. I bet there's more than 25 tonne. Yeah, no. yeah. You'll fit 20 tonne in a freaking 40 yard? Not lean. No, no, I mean, you'd fit that in it. Yeah. They'll be, yeah, they'll be 25, 30 ton. So, but well, I think they, have a, do. they have a way. Do, oh, yeah, yeah, so you can get it back on then. So, yeah, everything's running good. It is. There's a lot of little things what we need to improve, but you just sometimes need to look at the bigger picture and stop stressing over the little things because. A lot of little things, they can be sorted when we get more manpower and more management. Because at the moment, me and James are managing it on our own. And it is quite a big operation. We're quite impatient, aren't we? That's what we yeah. need. Uh, a lot of bigger companies, they'll have... <laughs> I did that. Uh, they'll have a lot of management, like in certain sectors, like even just the dispatching and picking, they'll have their own management. 
the transporter uh, manager. Um, we're, the everything. we're the everything managers. We're aren't the we? everything managers at the moment. When there's a problem, they come to me and John. Yeah. I'd love to just have that person who they can go to. Yeah, it's just sorting out little things all the time. Even down to the software failing on certain things. Oh, bloody hell, you can't list now because it's just something's going wrong and you have to fix it and this and that and you've got to keep it going all the time. That's the aim of the game. As long as it's busy all the time, you're earning money. See you soon, boys. Oh, I thought you did a piece then, John. I thought you did one of them little no, pieces. Do you remember you did one of them pieces? No. You did one? Not right, one. we'll see you at the college. In a bit. NH56YT. I don't think it is. I think it could be that one then. There's two in there. There's three, but the bar, there's one in. Right, so we're here now. Uh, feel like that's one of the minibuses there. And then there's another one over here. So we'll see what they like, see if they run, see how easy it is. And yeah, we'll show you a bit of loading. That's all loaded. That's a long wheelbase as well. And it's sitting on there nicely. It's literally not even overhanging hardly, just a tiny bit. But I probably could have gone forward another six inch. So the daft's definitely coming in handy. Uh, I was gonna put one on the spec, but I think it's just too much for the spec. For such a short journey, maybe I might as well just not do that. So John's just sorting the logbook out. I'll see you back at the yard. Right, first one's unloaded, I've just got it there. They're actually quite clean uh, vans, these. It's a shame, really. Look how clean that is. All the bits will be good, and it's got all the minibus seats. So look at that, wow. Ideal for a camper conversion with this. 100. 
Right, I'm going to go and get the next one. I'm going to bring Oliver with me just to do the winch and it just makes it a bit easier. Oliver, you're coming with me. Can I nick Oliver off you, Ryan? You can have him if you want. like. You can do the winch, yeah? And we'll get that door. Right. How are we managing? Not good. Not good, right? Too stressed. Oh, damn, both like selected stressed. Are you stressed, though, eh? No, I'm all right. I am. Right. It is busy, eh? I've got to admit, the pressure's on. When there's pressure, you, the stress does start to come out. Now, I've been the same. It isn't stress, it's the pressure building up. But you've got to keep on going or else it'll get worse and worse and worse. Anyway, I'm going to get the next one. I'll show you that. Right, Oliver, come on, let's go. You're doing what? Oh, well, yeah. Yeah, we'll get the door and then we'll get this mini bus. Today is a day of footage. What do you reckon, Oliver? Yeah. You up for that, aren't you? Right, so we're going to get this next mini bus. Uh, John's actually, we got back then and he was shaking, wasn't he? Like a bit of an alky, wasn't he? He was doing the alky shake because uh, there's no coffee. So, John, he does need a brew. Like, I've got to give him that. He can't function without one. Dude, you, you have brews, don't you? Do you need one, though? You don't need one, do you? You're more of apple juice, aren't you? <laughs> Any juice, you like juice, do you, lad? Uh, so, yeah, we're going to send Oliver in to get the coffee, yeah? But we don't make you making the brews, though, do we? No. Only because he did the right thing. I asked him once. Oh, Oliver, make us a brew, will you? Probably up there with the top five worst brews I've ever had, wasn't it? But make you a brew. Didn't know it was that bad. Oh, right. Yeah, it was that bad. So I do the same. If you make a bad brew, you'll never be asked again. Anyway, see you soon, boys. Ooh, face and backwards as well, isn't it? That's going to be a right nightmare. Is it? Uh, I might have to put it on backwards. Will it drive? Nah. It's going on backwards, lad. Forget it. It's going on backwards. Yeah. Right. Just had a. Not a nightmare, but a little bit of a pain load in that mini bus up. Uh, Oliver was on the winch. I'm not going to say any names, but someone's around the winch upon himself. Oliver's <laughs> on the winch. <laughs> no, it happens, it happens. But that's not the problem. John's just rang me saying the Arctic Volcar is reversing down the hill right now as we speak for the engines. And it was all then it'd be for this afternoon. So the yard isn't even ready. Uh, it's just a bit of a dark way. But I'm going to have to rush back now, quickly jump on the machine, load this Arctic, uh, and then I need to go and get this other minibus to sort this winch out. So, yeah, that's it. But I did have a routine, didn't we, Oliver? We even said, and the plans are going to have to change. Yeah. Because I'm not literally just saying this Arctic was better than this afternoon, and it's turned up now only four hours early. <laughs> So he's going to have to just wait a little bit, unfortunately, there. The way it is. What have you got to say, Oliver? Uh, bit of a pain, really, isn't it? Yeah, it is, you're right. It's a pain, good lad. Uh, so, yeah, see you in the yard. Right. Big red button on top of that, big one, that's good. Right, just got back to the yard now. Where is the Arctic? Oh, it's down there, isn't it? Oh, yeah. Right, I'm going to have to quickly get on this machine then and load these engines.
you've got to say to Ninja Pete. Ninja oh, Pete. Yeah. Ninja Pete with the dancing feet. If you want to dance off with our dancing Pete, then bring it 1v1. <laughs> I reckon our dancing Pete might have you on the dancing. Not in a fight though, you're, you're quite a tank, you're the only one. Yeah, you are. Right, anyway, what's going on to her? Uh, well, I've actually caught up on a lot of things, to be honest. At last. Are, are you planning, on picking, up, are you planning on picking up the camera anytime soon, doing a bit of recording or not? Uh, no, because that's when we we'll get the new media assistant yeah. in Paul James. <laughs> well, your forehead look well shiny then. <laughs> no, I've got a tuft. I've got a tuft at the top of my hair there, because it's receding. Oh, that old, it receding. That old chestnut. <laughs> right, but let me see your hair. He's growing it, isn't he, John? <laughs> you can just see the back. Let me see the back. You can just see it curling <laughs> out the bottom. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> right. So the Arctic's done and dusted. That was meant to be this we'll afternoon's job. Uh, Jarrett wants to come down for the alley engines, which I'm going to be sorting, and I've got another minibus to get. And Zoe just booked another three cars in for Rotten Store, haven't you? Uh, yeah. Even though I told her I'm busy, John. Me didn't, didn't it? Well, that's I'm still going to have to get it. Yeah. Stop your whinging. I didn't start whinging, I said when you need to get getting nice Zoe, so you said they need getting today. Yeah. Well, they yeah. need getting back. They need yeah. getting today. What do I do? He's not messaged me back yet. Oh, you want that camera? Why is there another bag of hats on the floor? I'll just put it in a bag. Right, listen, I also want to apologise to everyone for the late. Uh, what? The orders, yeah. The, orders. Oh. the person responsible is moi. <laughs> <laughs> and it's moi. And Both moi. of them. Simple as that. He was moving office. Moving office, yeah. he was away for two days. He was away, uh, and then. We're but out, we're out of court till they arrive, don't you? We're, we're, we're actually we're making some fresh stock right now. Ready now. Oh, they're ready now. Yeah, they're all there. So all the parcels yeah. are there, ready to go. Thank you for all your custom, we appreciate it. Very much. The money all goes to uh, MBP, my back pocket. <laughs> <laughs> no, it doesn't, it goes back into the channel. Right, that'll do, John. I need to go and get this transit. Yeah. Oh, God, it's warm in here. It's, it's freezing. It's not freezing. It is not freezing in here. Yes, it's it very warm, though. Also, there. we've got a new yeah, door. Yeah, yeah, I need to go and get it. It's not new, it's a, don it's a donation. Of a subscriber. Wait, Someone's got a free door for us. Oh, good, thanks. Listen, when the word free is involved, James, James is straight. Yeah. Like a tramp on he'll, chips. He'll stop a it. tramp on chips. He'll stop Give him a shout out. I never do Do. Free door. Robert and Tracy. <laughs> Just want to say cheers for the uh, door. It'll keep me nice and warm. And it'll keep Zoe warm and save us on the lecky building instead of the, the heat coming out of there. Straight out here, it's gonna stay. It's like little pound coins coming out the out the door. <laughs> yeah, I know. And the heater's on double switch. What happened to the new heater? It broke. He started crying because he kept turning off. It broke. Well, yeah. Went, it? He bought cheap heaters. Well, well, you just went so to the So he did go to the pound shop. Wasn't John it? told me to go to the pound shop. <laughs> No, we need to. We need a new heater. Right, listen. I'm gonna take that heater back. Right, Twenty on. quid. Yeah. yeah, take it. I'm cracking on before someone gets the chin spin. <laughs> oh, we didn't get a receipt. We didn't give you one. That's why I'm because you've been back. So basically, I can't. So they won't even have a receipt machine. Yeah, so I can't even claim my frigging tax back because of you, and we've lost twenty quid. And so you didn't get a back I've actually, yeah, I saw a beige bit. Oh, it's John, you're paying for wrong. I bought that heater. I think I paid for it even myself. Did you? Oh. Yeah. I can still claim my petty cash. Right, listen, I'm going. All right, see you in a bit. Yeah. Oliver's been in the reception and he, he said, I want to show John something. He, Oliver wants to show you something, John. What? Well, I don't know. He might be stood in here with pants down for a while. <laughs> no, can you that? Right, Oliver. Yeah. Did you, you wanted to show John something, didn't you? Yeah. What? Very nice. Oh my god. Very nice. I'm not it, John, like he's done a good job, look, John. Look. Is it nice and sturdy? Eh? Yeah, and he's levelled it. It's pretty sturdy, that, isn't it? I'll tell you what, Oliver, you've done a good job there. Thank you. The colour just doesn't match 100%. No. But, but I'm say, thinking. We're thinking of putting it. Well, let's show it now, I'll get that side. This is going to be the new <laughs> This is going to be in as well this weekend, James. Um, yeah, we want it all sorted. This is going to be the new editing station. What about like that? Is that bit? Mm. I think it wants to go up against that. What, mm. just like that? Yeah. Well, I suppose, yeah. That's, that plug's just in the way, though, isn't it? 
But you can get in then, I'm there. It's a problem, man. No, I mean... Right. Just leave it, we'll sort it. Really? It wants to be the best space in the world, doesn't it? But just yeah, but no, it's, you just feel like you're looking at a wall all the time. Yeah. And when people walk in, they see a screen. Yeah. If Oliver's looking at Wilkes on Google, they're going to see it. <laughs> <laughs> right. Me and Oliver are going to go and get this other mini bus after I've unwrapped the winch after Oliver's destroyed it. <laughs> uh, hopefully, it doesn't take too long. What do you reckon, Oliver? I don't know. I hope not. Have you got your walking stick? What are you doing with that? Right, we're going, we'll see you in a bit, boys. Yeah. No, that's it. Listen, you're learning, lad. Right, luckily, we've fixed the winch. The tire needs air on it on this side now. Only if you look at it. No, it's only flat at bottom. Is it really bad? Well, when you had that van on, it was near enough rim. Nah, it wasn't near rim. Is it bad now? It's a little bit down now, yeah. Right, I'll do it when I get back. Right. right, we're off to the next one. See you in a bit, me boys. Yes, Mr. Right, you just hold that camera, Oliver, lad. Right, so, we need to go and get the door now, don't we? Yep. We'll get this mini bus, and then uh, get the door on the way. Right, so this morning has been very busy. Just coming up to dinner time now. So I'm gonna put the get all these little jobs out of the way. And this afternoon I've got uh, auto safe coming down for the uh, alloy engines. So it's just literally it's getting to the point where it's just non-stop. But it's good, it's a good busy because Imagine it being the other way, where you've got all these people working and machines and stuff what's costing money, and then you're not selling out and nothing's going, no cars are coming in. So I'm definitely not whinging, good busy. I'll see you at the uh, the next college, which is in Nelson. A big red one on top of the big one. Two and a one, two, three, hit it. Right, we're at Nelson and Cole College, come to pick up another minibus. Can you see it? Pick up a door. Pick up a door? Oh yeah, we're getting the door, aren't we? <laughs> right. Uh, I'm trying to find it. I'm struggling. But it's here somewhere. I'm just going to quickly ring the caretaker guy. And I'll show you loading it. Hopefully, Oliver, don't break the winch again. Sorry, Oliver. Yeah, no, yeah I'm never, you're never going to hear the end of that, are you? But, like I have said, as long as he's learning, that's the main thing. Right. Must be around the back here or somewhere. Okay, full bed off. Right. It's actually buried right down here. I'll show you. Whoa, 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 whoa. Go back down. Slide it off first. Right, hold it, hold it, hold it. Hold that camera. Look at that. Yeah. Yeah, don't lift it at the start. Right, tilt it a bit now. That's it. We'll get a recovery drive around to you one day, won't we, lad? Right, tilt it a bit more. You need to try and just keep it even as you're doing it. Go on, a bit more. Right, now tilt it up, lift it up now. So that goes down. Other way. Go on, keep going, keep going, keep going. Right, that'll do, that'll do. Right, so the van rolls quite easy. Just gonna chuck the winch on it now. And then uh, pull it up. Now I'm gonna go around the uh, subframe so I can get it right up to the bulkhead. Just going on that tower, you can't get all the way up, can you? No.
do it, lad. Middle one, isn't it? You can do it, lad. Yeah. Right. Oh, wow. Go on, you'll be right. Right. Listen, it should be tight all the time. Yeah, yeah but if it does what it again, you stop. I'm only going to get it here in case the wind comes off it goes away. Right, the action camera died before, so I just want to apologise for that. But we've got the minibus on. We're actually just at uh, Oliver's auntie's house now, collecting this wooden door. Uh, he's going to quickly get that. In fact, I might have to quickly tell him he's just chucked in the van. But we'll do that. So this door will actually go straight on the reception, which is handy. Right, Oliver, have you got it? We might have to just chuck it in the van, what do you reckon? You what? Oh, it's there. Right, I'll put the chuck that in there. I'll do it now, but I'll just hold the camera off, yeah? Yeah, look at that door, man. That's a good one, isn't it? Might need to go down the aisle, man. Don't forget the fit. Yeah, that's it. Right, that'll do. Right, you just saw that camera. Where's the seat? Underneath them additions as well. Right. So we've got the stool for the reception and some high visits. Nice one. Tell them the work for 20 quid a piece, what do you reckon? Yeah. Right, we're gonna get back to the yard. Right, let's go. Right, we're all done, aren't we? Yeah. Right, just grab that, just knock it off. In a minute. He's got it, yeah. Okay. Oh, James! Yeah. What was he called? James Mitchell from Scotland, I think it was. James Mitchell. Um, from Scotland. I've just been informed that you come down with some iron brew. Thank you for that. Uh, I'm gonna mute this phone. Sorry I missed you, but I appreciate you coming down all that way. You saw him, didn't you, Zoe? Yeah. Shout out to James. James, oh my, he's brought a full crate down. That must have been a tenner. <laughs> what do I, have? look at me, what do I want that I'll for? I'll just touch the control. Oh, right, cheers, pal. And cheers, James out. Mitchell. Oh my god, he didn't even give him a hat for free. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I didn't know he brought these either until Zoe just said. Oh, I am brave, he's definitely from Scotland, isn't he? Is it? Well, was it a genuine? Was he from Scotland? Right, I've said the call off Jarrah, he's on his way now for the alloy bin. What? We're getting these cars moving over there. Yeah, I'm going to jump on the machine now. Yeah, we'll we'll get these minibuses out. We're going to just add him, aren't we? Get them down. We need to get him down there. Nathan's too busy. Yeah, oh, just get him back. Get him running and we'll drive him down. Yeah. Yeah, that's what we're doing. He's taking out. Yeah, but I mean, he's going to struggle. Where are you putting that now? Where are you putting that now? We need to get them running now and get him down there. Yeah. Yeah. All we need to do out. is get these running and I'll, I'll just drive them down there. Gonna vomit. I'll sort that out. I'll just put them where the alley, alley bin is, just in a, in a row. They're going to have to. Uh, I'm just... Well, what, is there anything going in or out the garage now? No, right, no, no. let's put that on the ramp. We'll get Jarrett done and then we'll do it. I'll flip these cars out of the way. What have you got to say to your people? I wouldn't know Oh, you see what I mean? This is it, the pressure. Pressure boys. Right. I'll show you when Jarrett's here. Now that is the pressure, John, isn't it? Yeah, it is. Listen. The pressure gets to everyone at certain points. It gets to me sometimes, it gets to James sometimes, but today it's got Nathan. No, it's got three thumbs. Three thumbs, sorry. Has the pressure got you, Oliver? Yeah. Yes! <laughs>
yeah. The fresh has got Oliver. That's what we like. Should we do a brekkie in a can or what? Yeah. Right, listen. It's raining. The pressure's on, the heat is on. Jammer's on his way, by the way. There is no heat on me, pal. Yeah, the cold, the cold's on, but <laughs> listen. This is when the operation's got to run smooth and it's how you deal with it. Now, we are dealing with it very well. I'm just going to give you a quick brekkie in a can of just for Kenny and you, the people who want it. So, can we have it, Kenny, please? And I won't interrupt. A one, I won't interrupt, and a one, and a two, and a one, two, three, one. Breakfast in the can, yeah, no, mamma mia! <laughs> I can't help it on that mamma mia bit, but I, one day I won't interrupt. One day. Right, so I'm just going to make a bit of room now for Jarrett to get down to this bin here. Uh, it shouldn't be too bad, but it is what it is. Right, Kenny, what? all this bit of rubbish at the front here, yeah. we're going to have to just try and clear it. Right. Just yeah. in for any punctures. He's coming for that end one. In fact, I'll have a look inside that. I'm hoping it's three quarters full. If it is, we know we're hitting the right weight. Oh, yeah. Yeah, that should just do it. Because if it any more and it was overloaded on the weight, not the bin, but the weight, these hook loaders have been only legally allowed to carry 15 tonne. So there's no point overfilling it because like you saw in the previous video you just got to pull it back out you can't expect them to drive overloaded because it's not it's obviously dangerous but it is what it is yeah so anyway i'm just going to tidy up around here move them cars out the way and create some space i'll show you when the auto saves here Alright, so you rebuilt it? No. So you put it back together and we've got video evidence? No. Oh, he did, he did. Right, I'm going to try and go there again for each one. Right, what's it been like this afternoon, Freeton? Get a brew down here in a bag. Like this afternoon, what's it been like this week? I tell you what, when we went to the forklift before, I thought if I don't move, I'm getting chinned. You were. <laughs> yeah, you were. You, you were chinned as well, you Kenny, I reckon. You were getting chinned or my fucking resignation. Sorry Yeah, yeah. So it's P45 <laughs> or a chin. I'd probably take the chin, to be honest. Uh, right, what am I doing? Right. Brew time. Uh, Autosaver on the way. So what we're doing, we're adding the minibuses to the system now for parts. Uh, in fact, I'm going to show you inside one of them. They are clean things, but we've only got them from the college because they needed CODs on them, which uh, and they just wanted them to be, be destroyed. So you've got to do that legally. And obviously we can sell some parts. So these can never go back on the road. And that's the security, what the college want, you see. And that's really why we got it's them. New yeah, until Nathan false plates when I put a new camp conversion. <laughs> <laughs> no, we're not doing that. You been here? Do you, me, do you want me to help? Yeah. I reckon I'll No, you that. record. Whoa, you're hard. <laughs> John, not putting any effort into it. Everyone else yeah, is. <laughs> I am. I promise, I am. <laughs> I promise. Well, James. <laughs> Good job, lads. Done. Right, so nine hour Paul's here. Oh, oh he's got you some good here for nine hours. Oh, he's got goodies coming. <laughs> right. right, I've done two shots. Sean, are you <laughs> sorting auto set, Dave? Right, listen. You need to go around there, right? You need to go around Hello. there. Hello. Okay. Oh, sorry, look, Darren's on. Get Darren on. How are you? Oh, oh yeah, you didn't need to back down here either. No, no, I told Jared to get you to back down, but I managed to clear it. So you back down for no reason. Yeah. <laughs> right, so you're getting the bid on the very end with the alloy engines in. Just drop this next to it and then pull that one around and it's over. I'll get Kenny to watch it on. Right, Kenny, you just watch him. Alright, Darren. <laughs> Look at Nathan straight in there. I'm going to help you, my good sir. Good way to put it for the customers. Oh! Good. Ah, Jesus. Look at that. Wow. Nice, so good. That's isn't it? That's a proper job, man. Bloody hell. 
John, have you seen this? Oh, oh. oh my god, I don't want to get out of it. I'm in. I'm taking it off. Take 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 it off. Go and take a seat. I'm going to sit on there instead of my office desk. Not be comfy. It wants a lot more finishing off. I just did bare bones. Yeah, yeah. 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 Yeah, yeah
That's Paul. So he sent a voicemail to free to in the baths and I've got a sausage roll for you. Yeah. you say, I was Chris? pretty freaked out. I will. You I know what? what? I've just sussed it. I've just sussed it, John. Chris is bitter that you and Paul are mates. Oh, yeah, it must be. I knew there was some hurt. Must be. But anyway, whilst uh, we've been faffing about, Kenny has been sweeping the whole yard. I'll tell you what, it. Kenny, you've done a cracking job there, lad. Yeah, I've You can't there, actually yeah. see on the camera. <laughs> why, is it, why is it not showing anything? Doing that. Oh, it wasn't showing anything. I don't think we've had a too bad of a no, day. No, I think we've done all right. Done your entire yard, lad. How come is it when I did it, when I come back off holiday, nobody said a bloody you biscuit? Right. <laughs> you said a biscuit. Hang on, I did it with exactly the same way you've just done it. Swept oh. it with brush, then come and swept it all like that. But you, I did well, you just keep telling bro, yourself bro. that, Freetal. You need to cook. <laughs> if you cut that in half, and then it'll be your size. No, then I can stick it up the ass and do it with the rest of the job. I'll tell you what, that would work. <laughs> Running around with it up your butt. <laughs> it would work. Right. Anyway, what now then? John, get that. <laughs> so, we've so. had today... The bales this morning, the <laughs> steel engines, the alloy engines, uh, a lot of cars have been coming in. As you can see, I've not processed any cars today. And already, there's a huge pile what needs doing. You can't even see, but there's a lot. You can't see, but yeah. Ooh, so it's got a cold chimney then. Ah. So yeah. We've had a good day. A very productive day. I'm, what am I doing now? I mean, there's 20 minutes. Yeah, I'm not, so I'm thinking I might just click that bit over there. Yeah. And just get... I don't know what to do down here. It's just, we need to get these blocks in. Yeah, and then just tidy it up. Yeah. That's like one of the next jobs to be there. It is. And get some hard standing ground down. Yeah, but every time you we don't do it... Yeah, it's getting worse. It'll make a mess and then like, I need to just literally not process the cars and put the blocks in yeah that's it right i mean really i can get the stone tomorrow i might keep this open here for the wagon to just reverse straight in there yeah but you need to clean it all up first. i can do that tomorrow right, okay. right you might see that you might not i feel like this whole video all i've done on the camera's put my <laughs> yeah, thumbs up did, yeah yeah i've done it like literally a million times but i do try i do try so I'm going to finish off now. It's been a long day. Right, I'm going to... Uh, it's not over yet, pal. I'm going to get on the machine. Yeah, see ya. Right, it's the end of the day. <laughs> Kenny's banged a couple of Mickey J's out tonight. Well, that's the first one. Uh, I'll tell you what. Good day, bad ending. Unbelievably bad ending. Save it till tomorrow. Should we sit? No, I, I'm dying to get it out there. Save it tomorrow. No, I'm dying tomorrow to get it out. I'll fix it for you. If free tongue can fix it, you broke it, pal. Over tightened it. Right. What's happened? James has been rough again. No, the machine. No, 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 broke no, no. It. no, no. I think Chris right. is trying to sabotage hang on, hang on. Every machine that we've ever recorded and that you've been on, you broke. Listen. Let, let me and listen. You broke every machine you have ever every, been. Every. Listen. I'm going to you. Right, see ya. The fitting on the machine. He's broke as you. I think Freetown yeah. over tightened it yesterday. No. Do you mean? Yeah. Do you know when I said to you, have you over tightened it? And you said no. Yeah. Why haven't we got a spanner and a hammer there then? <laughs> yeah, that's never the time, is it? No, no, do you know why I did that? I said to Freetown, is it tight enough? And he said no. When you said it's not biting the thing. Yeah, it wasn't. So I tightened it more. And then, you heard, and then you heard a little crack and went quiet. <laughs> <laughs> no. so, hang on, right, you're trying to blame me, but who had all of the spanner? Who had all of the hammer? I had all of the hammer. <laughs> <laughs> right, the hammer. listen, the, no, the fitting is broke because it's got come undone and tightened so many times, and it's the pressure and the vibration. Oh, or I'm going to keep telling go. myself that. Always an excuse. So, anyway, we're going to fix it in the morning. Uh, yeah, we'll do. Yeah, I might just get Freetown on it. No, I'll do it. Why is the closed? Shut up. I'm going to get a new fit in, get it sorted. Uh, John ain't going to be happy when I tell him the bill for the oil's going to be another 150, eh? I'm surprised you let you get an electric radiator in there. I thought you'd wear no, it. mine off. You cut plug yeah. off it, Kenny. Turn mine off. I'm in the gold now. It's not yours. It's mine. <laughs> Which one is yours? That oh, radiator. is your dad, eh? Yeah, <laughs> caravan. Right, anyway, so... It's not been a bad day. 
Everyone's yeah. going home now, so I'll see everyone tomorrow. Oh, we bailed in the morning, didn't we, buddy, this morning? We did bail Same this again morning, tomorrow, yeah. buddy. Do you want to? Should we just say yeah for the camera? Yeah, should we do it? <laughs> see, see you tomorrow Can't morning, buddy. Same again, buddy. Oh, Cappuccino, bail, buddy. Can't bail. Cappuccino, buddy. Yeah, but we're, we're still, still coming with bail. cappuccinos, though. Yeah. We'll sit you around and keep have a sweet. Keep them sweet. Yeah, it's up here. There. Yeah, what, right. what a chance, Not a chance. Not Kenny, are we going to get her? I'm in tomorrow on camera or not? I'm in tomorrow. Oh, my man. Are we having bets or what? Should we not? Oh, you can, you're allowed to bet that he's not in. Oh, what do I make profit if I'm in? <laughs> well, you're earning other people money. Oh, no, Kenny, I'm section. Right. Have we got all the I'm going. Simple as that. Right, everybody. Things need to be done in a particular order. We're going to be wrapping up now, just finishing off on the computers, uh, kind of preparing everything ready for the morning. To be honest with you, I would have actually come in tomorrow and bailed, but, we can't. but the machine's down. So I feel like Chris was quite happy. <laughs> like, because he said, oh, no, we can't, smiling. <laughs> So, I think we'll let him have a, a day off. A well, then your boots are filled for germs. Yeah, John, I know. Jesus. Uh, so, yeah, we're going to finish off for today. I hope you've enjoyed this video because this was all done in a day. Uh, we've managed to keep busy and keep the recording going. Yeah, we've got quite a lot today. Uh, I would have liked to have maybe done a bit more on the machine this afternoon, but it is what it is. I'll have to catch up tomorrow. Yeah, we've still got them three vans, though. Yeah. We? Not a bad day. Three big twin wheel, so long wheel base. Don't forget to like, share, comment, subscribe, get enjoy, involved, get in enjoy, there. enjoy. Like though, definitely like. Yeah, you need the likes them. because I know a lot of you like the videos, but you don't, you don't like, like them. them. So how can you say you like no, them if you don't like you them? You don't like them if you haven't liked them. Yeah, so let's prove it to us how much you do like them. Yeah, let's try and get... Just press the like, yeah. that's all you've got to do. Yeah, press that like button. And that'll do more than you think, so if you want to support us, I'm milking it now, aren't I? You are. If you want supporters, hit the like button. <laughs> Till next time. See you later, boys and girls. My right, big button on top, John. On the one that says off. I always say that to all of them. Big button there. The one that says off. <laughs>